I'm not going to force you to obviously go to Juma. I realize that that's not something that you typically do. No. However, I would love for you to do. Um, but also, you know, in our religion, it's, it's, it is, it is an obligation, compulsory for men, men women, children to men. learn your not religion. You don't know what I was about to say. Okay. See? So what I'm saying is it is compulsory for us, men and women, mm -hmm. to learn mm -hmm. our religion, right? Yeah. Can I ask you, can I ask you something really quick? Yeah. Why every time we have a discussion, you give me a lecture. Do you feel like it's a lecture? All the time. Okay. You do 24-7. Interesting. Yeah. When Bilal goes into lecturing mode, he puts on the lecturing voice and he changes and he explains and he speaks slow and very articulate. I feel to respond and say, yes, daddy, no, daddy, okay, daddy. What I've said today is that I am not going Juma, full stop. And if I say like, I don't feel like taking a shower for the next three days. <laughs> You know, you ain't gonna smell of this beautiful aroma. Uh -huh. Smell pretty good, don't I? I? I think your hand is on my pen. Why do you have pins on the couch? Because I stick pins sometimes when I take off my hijab and I forget to put it back. Is that a problem? Yeah, that's a problem. Do you know how, first of all, how expensive this couch is? Um, is it an ear couch? Is it going to deflate if do I put you, pins on it? Do you know how expensive this couch up? is? Yeah, it could mash up. With one mash up or my two bank pin? account. Come on, baby, being ridiculous. Yeah, I'm not being ridiculous. Why would you? Welcome to having who a hijabi does, wife. Who does that? This is something we do. We keep pins on the cushions. I want Shadi to feel like this is her home. She's the queen of the home. But there's also a fine line where when I see things that are left everywhere, like the little pins that you have that you keep in your scarf, like don't leave it in the couch. Don't leave it on the floor. I just stepped on it like 17 million times. Just kind of put it away. Ever since I came here, I've been doing everything, like everything that you want me to do. But today I felt like, you know, switch it up. I just know that, you know, you you want to meet people and talk yeah, to thank people. Thank you for this, babe. But and all I, those different things. I'm too. not coming. The number one reason that I came attracted to her was because of her her faith and her regards for Islam, for Muslims. Our religion is the most important part of our marriage, uh, without a doubt. I'm not coming, okay? Is that okay? It sounds like that's, you know, you kind of like headstrong, that's what you want to do. Mm 